this is the application for automatic toll kit. Uh, you will have a Audio Raspberry Pi phone board. Uh, you have to connect the USB camera, uh, IR sensor, uh, a manual push button to open and uh, close the gate. And uh, this is a uh, servo motor, SG90 servo motor. We are assuming it as gate. And here you have to connect the Type C mobile cable and connect to your, to your mobile phone charger only. Don't connect to the laptop okay so connect to the mobile phone charger after that using the our mobile phone hots uh, hotspot and screen sharing videos screen share the screen to your laptop so in the laptop you will have application here automatic uh, uh, toll gate if you double click on it the camera and the application opens but before that uh, we have to do some uh, configuration so initially what i have done is i have taken the images of uh, uh, some cars you can see here so these are the car numbers which I have taken turn off the light so these are the car numbers which I have taken now what I will do is I'm opening it and here these are the cars 1, 2 and 3 with number plates and uh, we will take uh, photos of these uh, things and we will analyze the number plate and thereafter we will do it but for that uh, we have to create a database of the known car numbers so what i will do is i'm um, uh, go to the file manager okay in the file manager you will have a folder called vehicle number database So this is a vehicle number database and I have already created one vehicle number data that is WB06F97 and for your sake I am creating another one that is HR26DQ5513. Everything should be as how it is shown in the number plate only. So right click. Go to the vehicle number database folder. My network is a little slow today. Right click, create new file. Whenever this window opens, you have to write the uh, number of the number plate that is HR26D I am again going to the VNC viewer caps HR26D Q5551 like this you can create any number of databases and you can also remove it triple five one dot txt txt should be in the cap small letters so I'm cross checking with the number plate that is HR26DQ5551 HR26DQ5551 press OK now it is saved so I have two numbers databases in the database and uh, other number is not available other car number okay and my environment is also very much uh, dull so, uh, so uh, whatever the data we get we have to be analyze it carefully now i'm closing this one So after creating the database, open the application by double clicking this icon. 
so whenever double click icon the uh, servo motor will uh, come to the normal position off position and uh, this will be your uh, application just drag the uh, sudo window to site to see the instructions okay uh, and so I'm opening one uh, image and uh, I will show it to the camera this camera is let's see with this uh, image is within the frame or not I am only working with the uh, cam as well as so now uh, it has to come completely so now I've just adjusted the camera for the exactly number plate as I'm working on the single screen uh, now uh, I'm placing the finger uh, finger nearby the IR sensor so whenever the IR sensor I place with the finger immediately uh, in the screen you can see that the system has identified uh, the number plate which we got from the online and uh, as uh, it is a valid number plate it has opened the gate and closed it uh, in second let me again I will show the name image only okay now I'm placing the finger so as the the number is available in the data set uh, the gate opens here closes okay now uh, we will test for the other image which is not available in the data set so this image is not available in the data set now let's see what happens i'm uh, placing the finger So you, you see it has detected MH12DE133 here. The image was MH12D1433 and it is shown as false. So the number is not available in the database. Uh, that's why uh, uh, it is showing number plate not available in DB pay manually. So whenever the person presses this button, then the gate opens and then it closes after five seconds so you can assume this as the gate uh, path of this thing button is available uh, and uh, whenever the person comes uh, uh, manually he can press it and opens closes and see that the number uh, the, the number plate has to be shown if you send any image uh, without any number plate then whatever the previous data is there it will be taken uh, as the assumption now we can test this image hr26dq uh, now i'm placing the finger so as i place the finger it will take the photo it will analyze it see hr26dq551 opens and closes if it is matched with the database it will what I can what I will do is now I go to the database to show it again I'm going to the database I'm deleting this file so now I've deleted uh, now I show the same image let me check in the camera frame whether the image is visible or not we'll close this thing
image okay so the image is shown in the camera there will be a delay in the image shown i'm placing a link take an image it has decoded and you can see hr disk is false it is not available as i have removed from the database so this is your application